Hey, everyone, how are you, good? Wow, you responded. How did you know to do that? So you have that queer eye for the straight guy show. My favorite guy on that show, the grooming guy. He always acts shocked when these guys don't use the right products. They'll be like, oh my God, I can't believe it. You're a 50-year-old taxi driver from the Bronx and you don't use chamomile antioxidant. <laughs> Under eye wrinkle reduction jelly? I am flabbergasted. I saw this show about sperm bank babies who are trying to find their biological fathers. And now the sperm banks are actually hooking these people up with an audio cassette message from the father. I wonder what the typical message is. Hi, Tommy, this is your dad. Stop looking for me. I never wanted a family. I wanted 50 bucks. I'd love to keep on a chit-chatting, but I still have about another thousand cassettes to make. You guys watch MTV here, huh? Yeah. yeah. MTV has this great show, Cribs. Rock stars showing off their houses. They had this guy from the band Third Eye Blind. He's walking around his apartment, he picks up a guitar, he goes, oh, this is my favorite guitar. With this guitar, the songs write themselves. <laughs> yeah, blame the guitar. <laughs> I saw an interview with a Victoria's Secret lingerie designer. This guy said Victoria's Secret has actually toned down their designs because of September 11th. <laughs> he said it like it made perfect sense. <laughs> I just can't believe there's a woman trying to seduce her boyfriend. The guy's like, whoa, honey, have you not read a paper lately? <laughs> So prostitution's legal in Australia. That's, that's good. That's excellent. It should be legal in the United States. They advertise in the yellow pages. Look in the yellow pages, you see ads for escort services, massage parlors, and they have slogans just like any other business. I saw one that said, we give the best service, no hidden charges. <laughs> What kind of hidden charge are you gonna get from a prostitute? <laughs> Guy's gonna get his bill, all right? $200 for sex, $50 for rust proofing. <laughs> you got the body shop here in Australia. I love the body shop. They should call that place last minute thoughtless gift warehouse. <laughs> You can be a sleeping shop there. You're like, all right, what do I got? Pineapple bath gel. Let's see, my sister eats pineapple. She bathes, boom. <laughs> nice bottle, no need to buy wrapping paper. Total shopping time, nine seconds. <laughs> Thanks a lot, everyone. Okay.